a quantity of grain estimated to be 100 ton shifts transversely by 10 meter and upward by 2 meter so the grain shifts from this position to this position say in this direction so the transverse distance is 10 meter and upward distance is 2 meter we need to find the list cause so the list cause is 10 theta list moment divided by capital W which is the displacement and GM here we should also note that the list moment cause is the final list moment and the displacement is also final and GM is also final in the list formula so here let's work out with this one first the list moment well we can find the final list moment FLM by simply multiplying weight multiplied by distance so the weight and this distance is a horizontal distance or a transverse distance well we call transverse if the ship is we are looking the ship in port and starboard direction that is the transverse distance so uh, weight moved is in this direction so now let us work out the list moment well it is 100 into a d which is 10 so that gives me 1000 ton meter and the direction of this list moment will depend in which direction the grain has shifted say in this picture if it is shifted from port to starboard so the list moment will be towards the starboard however if it was shifted from starboard to port the list moment will be towards port now WF WF is the final displacement we didn't load anything we didn't discharge anything so the displacement given is 10,000 ton so we have WF as 10,000 ton because we just shifted only there is a shift of cargo no loading no loading or discharging now the third part the GM final well GM is already given which is 1.5 meter however there is a shift in upward direction and this will affect the GM so we need to calculate the final GM well we can find the final GM by considering this effect of vertical shift so first let me write the formula that GG1 will be W into D divided by W F again the final W is used here and this shift is in upward direction say the G was here and M was here so GM is given as 1.5 meter now I had shifted so let's find out this uh, W which is going to be W was 100 and the distance shifted is 2 divided by 10,000 WF is the same because there is no loading or discharging so this will let's work out this cancels so it gives me 0 0.02 meter now if we look at this so K is here G is here and M is here since there is a shift in upward direction there is a shift in upward direction there is a shift here in the upward direction so the G will also shift upward so G the G1 so new GM let me mark here new GM will be the old GM which is a GM minus a GG1 so it is going to be 1.5 minus 0 0.02 so this will have 
1.5 minus 0 0.2 which is 1.48 meter so now we have all these three parameters we have the gm we have final displacement and we have the list moment also all we need to do put all these values in this formula 10 theta is equal to final list moment uh, divided by wf into gmf so let me just put these values so i get 10 theta final list moment which is 10000 divided by no this is 1 1000 list moment is 1000 this is the list moment 1000 divided by 10000 into 1.48 well i just need to cancel this so i get 1 by 14.8 so 1 by 1 by 14.8 gives me 0. Point, 0. 0.067 567567 and all I need to do is get the 10 inverse of that so 10 inverse of this value is will, will give me theta which is 3.8654617 or simply theta is equal to 3.9 degree port or starboard it will depend where the grain has shifted.